welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Elder, and you already know if this is your first time tuning in, I welcome you with love, hugs, and kisses. Mwah. But listen, in order for you to be my cousin, right, right, I need you to hit the subscribe button, right, right, and then I need you to light up the comment section with hashtag die cousin gang, okay? Then you'll officially be my cousin, okay? And those of you that's been rocking with your girl, you already know. For me, cuzzo, I love you, babe. I love you, cuzzo. You already know how we get down. So we be live. Welcome back. Back. Hey, back. Back. Hey. Happy Mother's Day to all my beautiful mothers, those that play the role of a mother. Happy Mother's Day. And as I told y'all before, it is a fight today. It is a fight. But we're going to affirm, we're going to speak life, and we're going to govern our thoughts, okay? We're going to take captive of every thought and let it be surrendered unto God, okay? Because we're going to have a beautiful day. All right, a beautiful day. But let's go ahead and get to the church his naive, okay? So that we can uh, uh, worship the Lord, amen? Worship the Lord. So let's go. All right, y'all. We are on the way to the church house. Sorry, I was reading the text. But, um, <clears throat> like I explained to y'all, earlier <clears throat> um, Mother's Day since I became a mother became a little difficult for me um, at the time I was with somebody who was not mature enough to understand to celebrate you know you as an individual so call it what you want but you know I was in my feelings you know so this year I said I'm gonna make a sound decision not to entertain it because I know if I feel this way how many other women feel this way so baby girl my love Mother to mother. Let me talk to you mother to mother. Okay? I celebrate you, boo. I celebrate you every day. We are not limited to one day. Okay? Because what us women go through, what we endure, what we carry, what we birth, naturally and spiritually, okay? It ain't easy. So I celebrate you every damn day, sweetheart. Okay? I celebrate us every day. We are not going to be limited to one day. But I want you to know you are a phenomenal mother. And I want you to give yourself credit. Because we often beat up ourselves because of this and that. And you know how our thoughts run. Okay? But today, we are not going to discredit ourselves. Okay? But we are going to give ourselves the credit for getting up and keeping and keeping it pushing and doing what we got to do for our kids okay kid or kids all right do not discredit yourself give yourself credit because baby we strong we are strong this is mentally emotionally spiritually like we carry so much we carry so much so I appreciate you. I value you. I speak life into you. I speak comfort into you. I speak strength into you. I speak abundance. I pray that I decree and declare that you walk under an open heaven in every area of your life. In Jesus' name. I rebuke that depression. I rebuke that doubt. I rebuke that fear. I rebuke that anxiety. I rebuke that oppression in the name of Jesus. But I call forth that you walk in alignment to the fruit of the spirit. And that there's no lack in your life. There's no lack in your home. There's no lack in your finances. There's no lack in nothing. You have everything that you need. I decree and declare that your faith be made effectual by the acknowledging of every good thing that is in you by Christ Jesus. Mother. Mother to mother. I love you girl. 
I love you, girl. And you got this. You got this. But y'all, I don't know. I might treat myself to a purse today. I want a brown purse. I have a lot of black. I have my black purses. I have my jelly um, purses. I have a red, a green, and a blue, a clear. And then I have a clutch, the lime green clutch. I have the burgundy book bag and I have the brown book bag, but I don't have a brown purse. I do have the brown messenger purse from Michael Kors, but I don't have a brown big purse like this. So I might treat myself to a purse today. Maybe, maybe not. Because we technically, we supposed to be on a financial diet, okay? <laughs> And for those that don't know what my financial diet is, my financial diet is ain't no money coming out. <laughs> now, unless it has to do with gas, food for like grocery shopping or bills. Okay. Yeah. So that means there's no fast food. There's no restaurants. There's no none of that. Okay. I already broke it. Celebrating, you know, cuzzo. So, it, <clears throat> baby. <clears throat> but let's go. Woo child. <laughs> when I said the devil big mad, the devil big mad. <laughs> After I just got through affirming you guys, I sat in the car for a second, you know, get myself together before I go into service. And a whole breakdown tried to come over me. <laughs> and I was like, no. 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 You either entertain it or you overcome it. Okay? Y'all, I had to say no. But we made it to the church house. Okay? Whew. Um, yes, we made it. And. Don't get shot. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so I wasn't expecting this this morning. How y'all doing? I know I ain't supposed to have it, y'all, but I mean, right? But I'll be back. Yeah. So, we hear y'all. We hear. Hey, my love. I'm good. How are you? All right. So, we hear you. Why are you on the second row? Last week, I let you slide. Y'all see my peoples? What, really? Y'all, my handsome cousin, my worshiper. y'all church is over i got something to eat i went home 
8 and I got back on the road, I was too emotional to speak, to vlog, to whatever. <clears throat> the word that was brought forth brought so much confirmation, but also put me in a hole. So I was gonna go to the mall and um, cause Michael Kors, I was gonna go to Michael Kors, but I don't feel like driving way out there, y'all. I really don't, I really don't. But I'm on my way to the post office, check my PO box. And then, mail off this um, stuff for King and Pick up baby girl and come home and get her situated. Watch a movie and chill for the rest of the evening. I don't have nothing. I didn't have nothing planned for Mother's Day. I wanted to go um, to dinner because I really want to try this. Um, there's two restaurants on my the top of the list to try. And that's Bar One and... Um, Victory Lounge. I've been wanting to try them. I heard the food is good. Oh, I heard the food is good. So, with dots being said, that's funny. I'm willing to drive to IKEA, which is still um like eight minutes from Michael Kors, but I don't want to drive. Dang, that door look like it's not even open. And I need one of those boxes, y'all. All right, I'll be right back. Let me see if this door open. All right, why the post office playing? Self-service on Sundays is from nine to seven. It is 324. Why is this door locked? Why? Can somebody help me understand? That is a little annoying. But anywho. So I might just go to Michael Kors, y'all. Yes, no. I don't know. Or should I go to Ikea? I don't know. I'm just torn in between the two. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me figure out my life, y'all, because. Oh, man. Let me go to Michael Kors. Let's go.